Hey there all craft beer lovers, it's the side of Fanatic here, back again with another beer review. On the table guys we have a uh, interesting collab between uh, Belgium and uh, the United States. And we have their, uh, <laughs> or rather we have a uh, nice collab from New Belgium Brewing out of Fort Collins, Colorado. And Oud Berseel out of uh, Belgium. And this is their Transatlantic Creek from 2016. Uh, belonging to their Lips of Faith series. Uh, this is a uh, cherry lambic. Uh, first made uh, in uh, Belgium from Oud Berseel. Specialists in lambics. And then they send this one to New Belgium. Uh, looks really really nice guys. Just take a look at this lovely big 650 milliliter bottle Just a fantastic bottle guys uh, As you can see there it weighs in at 7% ABV Wood aged sour cherry ale Sounds absolutely amazing there. Let's see. There we go a little bit of text there it says that a uh, creek of two continents behold the fruit of our collaboration with Oud Berseel of Lambic Brewing fame. Uh, their creek, a cherry spiked Lambic, traveled from Belgium to be united with New Belgium specially brewed golden ale as well as wood aged sour beer pulled straight from our folders. For a blend of sour cherry bliss it's a new legend waiting to be poured. Sounds absolutely amazing, guys. Uh, there's the uh, bottle cap, New Belgium and their bike. Let's get this one opened up and see what we are going to get with this one. Nice bit of smoke on the bottle opening. And the beer is going out. So yeah, I've been really holding on to this one, guys. There we go. I'm gonna stop right there. Uh, 2016, so it should be properly aged by now, I would say. There we go, guys. In view, what do we have? We have our, an approximately, well, almost half a finger of a quickly dissipating head there. White, a little bit fluffy, but quickly dissipating. We have a, well, light to dark red, a little bit of a mix of both. A little bit hazy brew there. Looks really, really nice. Hazy, lambic style for sure. Cherry red. Let's get an aroma. Oh yeah, so you definitely got that lovely sour tart character to it. Yeah, cherries for sure, sour cherries. Yeah, jammy, fruity, tart. Oh, smells very nice. So I'm looking forward to this one, guys. With that said, cheers. And here's to New Belgium and uh, Oud Berseel and their Transatlantic Creek. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Yeah, very nice. Let's go for another one straight up. Mm. Mm. Yeah, oh yeah, so guys, right up front, nice, sour, tart taste of cherries, yeah, sour cherries, a little bit of an earthy taste in there, Terry tart, <laughs> cherry tartness, earthiness. Yeah, a little bit of kind of, almost kind of like a bready character to it as well. Gotta go for another one. Mm, yeah. You definitely got that Belgian style to it. Sour, tart, fruity. A little bit bitter finish to it. Mm. Yeah, so, mm, oh, kind of reminds me of a, uh, you know, like a unsweetened cherry jam something like that you know no sweetness you've got that sour cherries in there you got that kind of little bit of uh well a little bit of powerful bitterness to it kind of definitely runs there in the aftertaste in the end there of the flavor spectrum 
Very nice, guys. Very nice. You got that definitely that kind of aged character to it. Mm. Gonna go for another one. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, so definitely that kind of aged character. Very sour. Sour cherries. Mm. Yeah. Fruity unsweetened really really nice uh beer guys nice uh cherry creek uh lambic go slash golden ale from new belgium brewing and oud Bersel. we have their transatlantic creek from 2016 lips of faith series big 650 mil bottle guys very very lovely beer um uh, for me, if I'm going to be, uh, you know, slightly critical there, I would have preferred perhaps a little bit more uh, emphasis on the cherry side of things. Uh, don't get me wrong, there are definitely cherries in there, but I would have preferred a little bit more uh, in the cherry section, to be honest. But I mean, it's a nice, nice beer, worth waiting for, nice uh, creek, nice Belgian-American uh, collab there, a lot of fruit sourness tartness yeah very nice rating wise it's a 3.5 out of 5 a 3.5 out of 5 guys from the side of fanatic that was everything i had for today please feel free of course to chime in thumb me up if you like the review subscribe to the channel if you want have a good one see you next time